You didn't ask me whether I refused or not. I did not refuse. Uh, I said, give me time to think. Because everybody knows what we have been going through for the last five months and ten days. And I appealed to her many a time. I appealed to the police commissioner of Calcutta many a time. I wrote him a very stiff letter eventually when they did not respond. It is more than amply proved what my cousin has done and it is wholly and wholesomely an act of a thief. God knows, my father knows, I know and my husband knows. He has admitted to his crime and we have it on the cell. And I have one Trump witness and I shall produce that witness when the time comes. So, in such a scenario, when she has not come forward or not even shown any condolence or any feeling for the family who is going through such a rough time, for five months and ten days my father has suffered. And when she has not come forward at such a time, neither has the police chief come forward at such a time after repeated requests and pleading, I have literally pleaded, then how do I, how do I treat this? Just, just you want the body to go to Calcutta when I have already arranged all the rights over here. As you've seen, we have finished within the given time. There is another party waiting for this hall. So I had a time frame within which I had to finish all my rights and I, because nobody came forward, I had to do it all myself through my very, very close friends that I have developed here in Bangalore. Can you uh, let me elaborate the, what the actual incident was uh, on which you had written to the police commissioner? Well, I think everybody knows that we wanted my father's funds, my father had kept his funds aside. We are only asking for my own father's money. We are not asking for him, you and all to give us chanda. We don't want. All we asked for, my father kept that money in good faith. And we asked at a time when he, you know what, five months of ICU bills can be in Narayan Hridayala. Please imagine and then tell me whether I needed those funds or not. I can't shake the tree and the coins will fall. Therefore, I have pleaded with the government and the government never recognized our plea. In that case, how shall I honor her words? Tell me.